the fuck going on with y'all man welcome back to another episode of boruto um what happened last episode honestly i kind of forgot shit let me just go ahead and check real quick what happened oh that's right borushiki we saw borushiki for the first time um which is pretty much uh momoshiki in charge okay uh, Boruto was either knocked out or just sitting in the backseat of his own body and Momoshiki stepped in and uh, well he grew some horns on Boruto's on Boruto's face the karma grew full full blue and uh, he also had a Byakugan on his right eye which is uh, which is probably Momoshiki's it could have been Boruto's I don't know because Boruto has the, ju the, the, the Jogan is that what you guys are calling in the comments he has a Jogan so uh, I think that was probably Momoshiki's eye because he was, I guess he was in control of the right side of the right side of the body. Anyway, yeah, Boroshiki, pretty fucking strong. Uh, he was pretty much tossing, ragdolling Boro, uh, the, the, the giant monstrous form of Boro with just simple kicks, simple punches. And also we saw him use the same super ultra big ball Rasengan that Naruto used against Delta, which is, you know, that, that's a that's a hokage level fucking jutsu and he was able to do it with boruto's body okay so yeah pretty strong so i want to say that's like a teaser um into what we're probably going to see in the future for boruto whether it be you know momoshiki still in the driver's seat or boruto in the driver's seat this time harnessing that momoshiki power who knows but pretty much last episode confirmed that some part of momoshiki still exists and it exists within boruto it could just be a spirit it could be I, don't, I have no idea to be honest it's too hard to tell right now but he definitely is still alive some way somehow um and right now it's a bad thing because i mean just like naruto he had trouble harnessing the nine tails power so right now it's a bad thing because at any at any moment momoshiki can, can just be like all right it's my body now right uh, so right now it's bad, but hopefully, eventually, just like Naruto did, he'll be able to, uh, I don't know about befriend Momoshiki, but at least harness his power and then use it for himself, right? Uh, and I imagine we're going to see somewhat of a similar thing to happen to Kawaki eventually with Ishiki, okay? Or Jigen, I should say. Um, so we can probably see that happening. And speaking of Kawaki, I'm feeling like he's um, he's starting to notice that his, his presence in the leaf is straight up causing them trouble i mean it is it definitely is but i mean that was naruto's decision anyway naruto knew taking kawaki in would start some shit because you know kara kara is as we have learned in recent episodes they are not to be fucked with all right especially jigen god damn he, he beat the fuck out of naruto and sasuke I, i'm still scarred by that moment of when jigen just kicked straight through susano <laughs> like what uh, anyway, yeah, so I'm not sure if Kawaki, I'm feeling like, you know, uh, Kawaki might run away because of that and just be like, you know what? Um, cause, cause we've seen him make the sacrificial play already with Boruto and Himo, with, with, sorry, with Naruto and Himawari sacrificing his right arm. So I, 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 I wouldn't put it past him to just run away and just be like, you know what? I'll, I'll, I'll either run away and get as far away from the leaf as I can. So everyone in the leaf is safe or he'll just go straight to Kara. So they, so they leave the leaf alone. Right. I can see that in, in, in part of his actions. Um, but yup, that's what happened last episode. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and jump into it, man. This is Boruto episode 209. Before we watch this, though, make sure you guys um, check below. OK, if you want early access to these reactions, of course, you can go ahead and click that join button down below and become a member of the channel. If you want early access and full versions of these reactions, you can go ahead and click that Patreon link down below. Link down below in the description, either or whatever you want to do. If you want to join our community, you can hit up our Discord server, which is also linked down below in the description. All right. Other than that, Borto209, make sure you like and subscribe. What? <laughs> That's true. The karmas, as as soon as Boruto and Kawaki have been together, the karmas have been acting like crazy, like they're making each other stronger. 
Like I said, that, that, that's a double-edged sword because it's going to make our dude stronger, but that's also going to have uh, Ishiki and Momoshiki have more control over them as well. You know what I'm saying? We probably got to have to figure out a way to suppress that first before we start making these karmas better. Oh. Is that a dog? Or is that a wolf? It looks sick. He's got a lot of scars, too. Damn. Oh, are we doing the thing where we're, we're, we're comparing Kawaki to a lost uh, animal again? We just did that. Oh, well. <laughs> yeah, Hinata's not scared of you, buddy, because she can kick your ass. All right. Don't get it twisted, Kawaki. <laughs> <laughs> we might as well take him home. I mean, might as, yeah, we might as well take him home. I'm sure Naruto and Hinata will be fine with that. Do they have a pet currently? No, right? Might as well, dude. Also, I'm pretty sure he's going to get roughed up out there with those other wolves. Well, there go his there goes his like PTSD again, except that was more of like a flash forward in a way. I mean it's pretty terrifying. At any moment Jigen can travel through his hand. <laughs> and we don't really know. We're definitely being a little too lenient right now, but it's alright. Oh god. Don't do it. <clears throat> Don't do it. Did that fucking wolf just get mangled by a bear? We're about to find out. Or Humawari's about to find out. He did. He just took him home. Mama would have had no problem with this, man. At least there isn't, uh, you know, any any death marks. Because, I mean, in the real world, the bear would have chewed right into that fucking thing, right? <laughs> so at least there's not that. Because, I mean, shit. Himawari would have been, like, forever scarred. Okay. That's a nice little lesson for him and Wari to learn. I mean, the sooner the better. She's going to become a ninja too, right? She's got the Byakugan. And she also has that Gohan thing where she has like a, a hidden power. I definitely feel that. Is he trying to leave? I think he is. Yeah, I saw this coming. It's a pretty, pretty normal feeling. If you feel like you're a detriment to, you know, your your surroundings, then, you know, one of the first instincts is for you to leave so everyone's all good. Right? I understand that. He should stay, though. I mean, he saw what happened to the other wolf. <laughs> 
て行くのが一番いいってことぐらい花から分かってたさけどお前ら家族のせいだよバカ野郎おかげで感覚が鈍っちまったじゃねえかちくしょうだからこんなクソみてえな里出て行ってやるんだよ Damn That was harsh Then again he's doing the, the whole Sundari thing right I don't even know what that's what it's called but it's when someone acts mean when they're really not Oh It's not letting him leave That's funny. That was a small detail, but I did like how he he wouldn't let him leave with the shadow stuff. <laughs> it's a small thing, but I I do like that. That was cool. Kamaki. Yeah, you are. Let's go. And that was, that was cool too, because Shikamaru, I mean, a few episodes ago was like, you know, we have to imprison you. You're a danger to our society. And now we're chilling. I also kind of like this duo because you know Kawaki is the most dangerous thing in the leaf right now probably and Himawari is the most precious thing you know the one we have to protect the most yet you know all right had a little slow episode there nice little slow episode again expected because they gave us, you know, Sasuke Naruto Jigen fight. They gave us the Boro fight. They gave us Sar Sarada Chidori. They gave us Boro Shiki. Honestly, uh, at this point, we expect slow episodes after fire stuff. It's just a thing that happens. I get it. It's to build up for the next thing. It's for it's for world building. It's for character development. I understand. I've watched enough uh, Naruto to know that. Okay, so it's all good with me um did we learn anything that episode not really not really um kind of already expected kawaki to, i mean i said it in the intro i expected him to walk away to run away because he feels like a detriment that is a normal you know human nature kind of thing if you're feeling like you're um you know you're, you're a menace to society then the part of you just wants to leave and and not and and not you know be a burden so that's a very common thing he did that. I'm glad Shigemaru stepped in, um, you know, because that's also some character development on his part, where he didn't—he no longer views Kawaki as an enemy. He views him as a member of the village, you know, and he's probably the most um, the most stickler right now of them all, because uh, he because he has to be as the assistant to the Okage. So, I fuck with that. I fuck with Kawaki. I fuck with Himawari. I want to see more Himawari development, though. I'm trying to see her kick some ass. You know, I, I want to see some training montages of her and her mom training or some shit. Because I'm sure they have. They just haven't showed it in the show. Uh, she is very young, though, so maybe not. But um, we, we've seen her Byakugan activate in the past. And we've seen her do some pretty cool ninja stuff. So I do want to see that. Um, probably not going to happen, though. There's too many things going on. Um, but I guess next we can expect that. Uh, hopefully we expect some more... Um, we're, we're knocking out the Karas one by one. Bor Boro is done for. We still have Delta alive, right? She definitely wants to rematch against Naruto. That may or may not happen. Uh, we still have Code. We still have Amado the Scientist. And of course, there's Jigen. Anyone else am I missing? No, I think we, we've we knocked out actually uh, most of the Kara outers and inners, possibly. I've got a feeling there's more outers. We've only fought, what, two or three of them? Oh, oh, sorry. I forgot to mention Koji Kashin. But at this point, Koji Kashin's probably on our side. Maybe? Who knows? I don't know. It's too hard to tell. Um, but yeah, so we still got some Arkara fights lined up. Um, and yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what, what's what's uh, what's next in store. Again, I'm we're almost caught up, guys. We're like 20 episodes away. We're almost caught up. Then I could watch it on a weekly basis. Yeah, give myself a little break. You know what I'm saying? Because I, I have been uploading these every day god damn day from monday through fridays for a pretty long time now <laughs> pretty pretty damn long time pretty much ever since we started the first episode of naruto uh, and back then i used to do double reactions like jesus um so 
Um, but yeah, that's going to be it for this reaction though, guys. Before I end, of course, if y'all want early access to these reactions, you can go ahead and click that join button down below and become a member of the channel. Uh, and if you want early access and full versions of these reactions, you can go ahead and click that Patreon link down below. Become a patron. Either or works, whatever you want to do. If you want to join our community, you can hit up our Discord server, which is also linked down below. All right. And um, yeah, I will see you guys next episode of Boruto. Have a good one. And uh, hopefully we get some fights next. All right. Peace.